guys, welcome back to my channel. I have today a plus size clothing try on haul. I have many, many different brands and lots of things for fall. So I thought I would just jump right into it. I'm actually filming this very lax. I have this big sweatshirt on that I'm realizing I should probably get rid of as it was a little too big last year when I bought it. And now it feels like a big oversized cozy sweater, but I love that. Um, I just got out of the shower, so this is very impromptu. We're actually leaving for the Dominican Republic later today. Uh, so this is definitely pre-recorded. You guys probably won't see it until we get back, but I wanna get these clothes hung up. So I already tried them all on, and surprisingly enough, I've bought from these places before, and I've had the company send me these clothes before from their site, and everything fit which is amazing to me I did keep out some stuff that I got that you guys will see either before or after this um, I plan on doing a like what I'm wearing for the day on vacation and I have some outfits that I purchased or that this company uh, these two companies sent to me so I have Rose Gal which you guys know I've collaborated with before in the past they did send me some items uh, Zayful same thing they have collaborated with them they sent me some items I have Walmart Target and I think that's it so let's jump right in I have it all kind of jumbled here but it is all fall and winter clothing so I will try and remember which pieces from what and as always I will have all of them linked down below as long as they're still available I'll link them for you so if you're interested you can go check them out now I've mentioned this before with Rose Gal and Zayful they are like sister companies their sizing can be a little bit strange they're for an overseas company so you do have to just kind of look at the sizing and see what the like conversion is to US sizing um, because some of the stuff I order like way bigger sizes than I'm wearing right now. Some of the stuff I ordered smaller sizes and surprisingly it fit. So um, this one is from Zayful. I got it in a US size 20. The brand is Next Mia Fashion. And it is a beautiful like oatmeal knitted sweater. I like that it's more form fitting. Most of my sweaters that I have are like this, like super oversized and baggy. I love the color on it and I love the detail up the front. It looks like braiding and then we have some crisscross with a key hole, key hole cut out um, there on top. And so this is one of them that when I pulled out I was like, ooh, that looks a little tiny. I don't know if it's going to fit and it actually fit pretty nicely. Now, all of my try-on were I had uh, black leggings. I wouldn't necessarily wear all of these clothes with black leggings. Like those I would probably wear with jeans or definitely not leggings. Those are That's a little too short and a little too tight for me to wear leggings with them. But that's what I had on and so that's what I wanted to continue in. Okay, this next one is a uh, from Rose Gal and it's a long like t-shirt sweater. And the brand is Rose Gal. Now this one I got in a size 4X, which I believe translated to a US size 20. Most of the clothes that they have translate like that. A 4X is a 20, a 5X is a 22, and so on. So this is what this shirt looks like. It has the red plaid look, and this is looks like a sweater on the website, but it's definitely more of like a t-shirt material. Um, it has long black sleeves and then the plaid red down on the side with the button detailing and the buttons are faux they're just for decoration and then the neck is kind of like a cowl neck you can turn it inside out like that and it shows the red plaid all the way around and it, this one is pretty long so I really liked that one if you couldn't tell I was going for fall clothing because I have so many clothes that I've purchased. I got through the entire summer without having to size down too much. I was able to just get like size 22 shorts that I bought on clearance last year and things that I purchased for Disney and I was able to get through the entire summer. For fall, I like my stuff oversized for fall anyway, so I didn't think I was going to have to buy a whole lot of clothing, but some things like this, I really enjoyed this. This is nice to lounge around in, but it's way too big for my personal taste to wear out even though I'm gonna wear it out today but you know what I mean like just in the future when I put it on I probably just wear it for lounging around the house or something like that it's just for me too big so I knew I wasn't going to necessarily purchase a whole bunch of clothing but it was nice when these companies reached out to me and I got to pick out 
a handful of things from each to be able to have on hand. This one is from Zafel and it's very similar. It's that next next Tima brand. Um, it's very similar to the red plaid one, just in a like cognac color. So it has the cowl neck here with the brown and black, and then it has um, black sleeves and on the side. This one is a little bit more on the tight side, um, and I did get it in a US 20, but it's, it's a little bit thicker material, so it is a little bit tighter, but definitely still doable for me, and as I continue to lose weight, it'll definitely fit better and better, so it has that brown on the side, and again, with the faux buttons. And I got one from this company last year that is like a maroon-ish color with some geometric print on it that I really like, which is what drew me to those. This one is also from Rose Gal. I got it in a 5X because honestly I thought it was a sweater, kind of like what I'm wearing. It's a t-shirt. Um, it looks like a sweater, but it's t-shirt material. So just be careful for that. It is a sugar school. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> and it was in the Halloween section, but I definitely would wear this all winter long gray and it's nice and big and oversized and I like it like that. So I picked up that one, and then I picked up this one from Zafel. This one's going to be kind of hard to show you. It is a U.S. size 20. Um, this one, uh, you'll just have, kind of have to look at me modeling it, but it's a like crossover tie shirt. It has some crisscross on the arms. This one is a tiny bit short, so I would probably wear it closer. I bought it for the fall, but... I would probably wear it closer to tax season when I hopefully am a little bit smaller um, just because it is a little bit short. It's cute and if I wore it with the right pants, I definitely could pull it off for sure not with leggings. It's entirely too short for my taste, but I love the coloring of it. I love the floral and I love the fact that it does kind of wrap around. Um, it just could use a little more length on it. So we'll wear that in 10 or 15 pounds, not a big deal. This one is super cute. I like this uh, shirt as well. Just a basic gray like Henley top. It's from Zafel. I got this one in a 3X. I was trying to see. So on Zafel's website, this shirt in particular, a 3X was a US size 20. So again, you can't, you can't just go based on, oh, I wear a 2X, get a 2X. Like you have to look at the sizing on each of the tops because it converts it for you depending on which country you live in. So this is just a basic gray t-shirt um, long sleeve and then it has the buttons and these are true buttons so you can unbutton them and roll up the sleeve or keep them buttoned and I like that a lot so just basic but super necessary for the fall we will stay we're cool now we got a little cold front and we will stay cool like this probably through November early December it'll start getting cold to wear like you'll have to wear this plus layer with a bunch of stuff so That'll be nice when it actually gets here. This one is from Zafel, again, US size 20, and same concept as the other shirts that I showed you. It has a cowl neck with some buttons, and these buttons actually can be undone. This is a color blocking shirt, so these buttons you can undo, but the fabric doesn't go anywhere, so I'm not exactly sure why. But it's a bright pink, gray, and black color blocking shirt, so I really like that. Um, I don't know, had I looked at this a little bit better, I don't know that I would have picked the bright pink one. It's a pretty shirt, probably more for winter time, but um, the it the bright pink kind of makes like your fatty area stand out a little bit, so do be weary of that for sure. Okay, next up, I got this because the company, this is from Zafel, the company told me they wanted me to check out some athletic gear. Well, I told them the plus size section doesn't have a huge athletic gear section to choose from, and I can't wear any of the stuff from the regular section, but I did find this. And when I saw it, I was like, oh, so many people owned like track suits like this. I want to be part of the crowd. <laughs> so I, I ordered it, and I ordered it in the biggest size that they had available, and when I pulled it out, this is one of those things that I was like, that's not going to fit. Like, I can just look at it. I got a 4X. I don't know if I said that. It was the biggest thing that I could. It was the biggest size that they offered. I don't know what it translated to, like, size-wise, maybe a 20. But when I pulled it out, I was like, that's not going to fit. <laughs> I'm just not going to be able to get that on. Surprisingly, it fit. Um, am I 100% comfortable in it? Definitely not. This area right here kind of, like, is more it's stretchy but it's tighter so it gathers my like lower stomach area my long hot area and makes me a little 
oh, like if I were a little smaller in that region, I would feel more comfortable. It's a comfortable tracksuit, but body wise, I don't think I would be 100% comfortable. But I do like the fact that it's all black and it has the white stripes down the front of the legs, which I think is unique. I really like that. And I do like the top. The top, it's it's definitely feels like a working out, you know, like that. What are those things called? Not it's almost like rash guard material that's kind of what it feels like um, but yeah it has a hood and I like the fact that it has the continued white stripes it's a little shorter again than my taste that's what the whole look is about and if I were a tiny bit smaller in my midsection I would for sure rock it so maybe end of winter early spring we'll try it again for sure okay this dress I love 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 I wish I'd got a smaller size I got it in a 4x which is a 22 and the reason I did that was because it's the like type of material that does not give it almost feels like straight up polyester I couldn't tell you I'm awful with materials but it's like that material that work outfits come out of you know <laughs> like dress shirts things that do not stretch like they have no give to them so and I could tell that from the picture so I was like let me size up just so I have plenty of room I wish I had got the 3x which would have been a size 20 I love the outfit though and if I tie the waist tight enough the shirt I mean it looks fine it's a t-shirt dress it's extremely cute I think if you work in any type of business world, corporate world, this would be very cute. I'm waiting to wear it to H&R Block in January or February. But like this, when I first pulled it out, I was like, oh my gosh, that's so big. And it is. If I don't have it tied, it's ginormous. So I wish I had even gone down two sizes. The sleeves are big, everything. So if you have ordered from Zafel before and you're like, oh, most of the time a 2X or a 3X fits me, I would size down on this, definitely. Because I got a 4 and I... I know for a fact I could have done a 3, maybe even a 2X, like a size 18. And if I get the opportunity to order from the company again, I'll probably order a smaller size because if I lose any more weight, this is not going to fit. But it's a super cute dress, super, super cute. So it's like striped, it's white and like a navy blue. I love the pockets on it and it's just very classic. Like I think of Charlotte from Sex and the City when I think of a dress like that. And it's just so cute and classic. I just wish I'd got a smaller size. Okay, so speaking of holiday, or dresses in general, holiday dresses are on the website. This is another one. I got it from Rose Gal. I wish I would have sized down. I got a 5X because, again, it looked like that material that didn't stretch. And it is the type of material that doesn't stretch. But I wish I had gone down to at least a 4, maybe even a 3. Because this one is a little bit big. But that's okay. I only need to wear it in the next like two months and then by next year hopefully it won't fit and I'll just get rid of it. But it's a black tank top dress. It does have some uh, like lace detailing on the sleeve and um, the bottom is Christmas. It's like again that polyester material that does not stretch and it has a plaid background and it has Santas and snowmen on it which I think is super cute. It's a very cute dress. I think it's super flattering. Great for holiday parties, especially if you're somebody that likes to wear festive things. I typically will wear like a red or a green sweater, but that's super cute. And I honestly cannot, cannot, cannot wait to wear them. So I think that was everything. Yeah, everything else is from Walmart and Target. So that was what I got from Rose Gout and Zayfell. And like I said, I did get, I want to say like three one two three four more dresses and a shirt and I have two more things coming so I ordered quite a bit they were a very generous company they always have been I love working with them I will definitely leave the links down below for you guys to go check it out extremely cheap but well-made clothing I have like props hands down if you're willing to wait for the shipping and the sizing is sometimes not like you have to just put in a little bit more work than just going to tour it and being like oh I know I'm a 22 or whatever it's definitely worth the money I have so many things from them that I love 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 and adore so highly recommend both of those companies I will leave those links down below for whatever is still available same thing for these because you guys know I love shopping at Walmart and Target as well so yeah, let's just continue. More fall stuff. This is going to show you a trend of the type of clothing that I wanted for fall this year. So you guys, if you've been following my daily vlogs for a while, you actually saw these at some point. These are from the Time and True brand. I bought these months and months ago. I feel like during the summer. 
In fact, I'm pretty sure I bought them during the summer. Time and True Brand, I got them in a double XL, which is a size 20, but they fit really nicely. This first one, um, they were $14.96. This first one is mustard. Clearly, I love this color, again, for fall. They are three-quarter sleeve, uh, three-quarter length sleeves. They're like a sweater material. See, I'm bad with materials. Rayon. It's a rayon material. <laughs> um, nice and stretchy, and then on the side here, it does have... A knot or like a slit in the shirt that's tied into a knot that has some long hanging things so this this is super cute I would personally probably not wear these with leggings uh, I bought two of them I probably would wear them with jeans but that's just my personal preference or if black pants like black skinny jeans or black skinny um, like slick pants I probably wouldn't wear them with leggings just because they're not long enough for me but hey you do you, especially if you can wear them a little bit bigger. This brand in particular at Walmart, the biggest you can go is a size 20. So I was lucky that these fit. <laughs> this one is a uh, like dark navy blue and white stripe. Same exact shirt, same size, same price, same sleeve length. And then the knot up in front is the same. Just a different shirt. You guys know if you've watched me before, when I find something I like, I buy one in every color. <laughs> Two more things. I know this one's kind of lengthy. I found this on clearance at Target for $14.50 and I bought it because originally we were going to go to Disney in January and the timeline just didn't match up with Andres's work schedule so I canceled the trip. Like we don't have anything lingering. So sad, I know. We may think about another trip next summer, but originally I had bought that this because I was like, oh, that'd be perfect for when we go in January. Well, now I have it and it is what it is. It's an extra, extra large and it was from the Mickey line. So it's just a blue pullover sweater, but it's kind of like a t-shirt sweater. It's not super, super thick and it has three Mickeys here, which it's really cute and I'll still wear it either like to lounge, to work out, or just wear it in general. Um, I mean, it was like $14, but I was really excited about it <laughs> for January. I thought it would be perfect to kind of layer, but it's okay. I'll have it for the future. And then if not that, then I can just wear it just in general. It fits nicely. And then the very last thing I found at Target is from the A New Day brand, which is a new brand at Target. I think they just got that recently. This is in a double XL and I found it on clearance and it was $14.98 and it is a white denim jacket. So not necessarily something that I would wear right now. Per se, I have a regular denim jacket that I probably would wear during the fall and winter. Um, this one I picked up just because it was such a great deal and it does fit pretty well, but it'll also fit me through spring. Like it, it won't be too big, I don't think by that point. So it's just a nice white denim leather, leather jacket. <laughs> And it looks nice and it'll go well with a lot of things. So yeah, that was my fall haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Lots of different places, lots of different clothing items. I will definitely continue to share these with you guys. I love trying on things for you because I know, especially as I've lost weight, my body has changed and you know, it's just so much easier to look at clothing on somebody's person versus just like, oh, I really like this shirt holding it up. Um, so I, I enjoy watching try on hauls. And so hopefully you guys do too. Let me know in the comments below some of the things you, you guys have picked up recently. Hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next one.